All right, I got the car loaded down and I gotta go to the post office. I have to take these inside. You can't drop them in the drop box there. They're too big to go in there. But uh, let me run take them and I get back and I'll tell you all about it. These people decorate every season here. Got a lot of Halloween stuff. Christmas, they'd really have a lot. I've been saying I was going to stop here and take a picture of it, but it goes down that way a good way. Good morning, everybody. I'm back home. Uh, I wish I'd have made more video on that uh, display of Halloween stuff out there. Uh, that's between here and the post office. Well, it's right past the post office there. And I've been saying I was going to stop and make a video of it. But uh, there was so much traffic, and it goes a long way down the, the road there. And they put something out every holiday. Uh, Halloween's big on Halloween. They got a lot of stuff, but they got even more on Christmas. I'll be sure to make the whole thing Christmas uh they keep that Christmas up longer. They've just put the Halloween out. I, I was beginning to think they wasn't going to put it out this year, but it's a, a subdivision or something right behind it there, and they put it out alongside the road there. And that's the main road right through there, pretty well main road. And uh, there's a lot of traffic on it, and I was going gonna, gonna to get out and walk down, but I didn't walk very far, so I come on back home. I went to the post office to mail those two packages. And they weighed 65 pounds. Let me get over here and find a picture. Okay, yeah, this is it right here. Uh, this small box here, that's something else. That's not the same as these big boxes. Uh, this one here weighed 32 pounds. And this one weighed 31 pounds. And this one here weighed a couple of pounds. It was like 65 pounds in all, but... These two here were 63 pounds, uh, and it was a, a set of encyclopedias, a 1975 set. Uh, I've sold encyclopedias before, you know, but it's been, it's been several years. I picked this one up at a sale here just a while back, oh, just a couple of weeks ago, really, and uh, it sold this weekend uh, for $50. I paid $4 for it, so I made good money off of it. And, of course, the people that bought it got a good deal on it for $50. They usually sell for more than that. I don't know why anybody would want encyclopedias other than just collecting. I mean, uh, you just everybody just Googles everything online now, now, nowadays, it seems like. But uh, you, you can sure sell them if you find any of them. And like I said, I... I run up on them every once in a while, and if I do, I, then I buy them, and I, I stick them on there and put a real good price and, and sell them. The only thing, uh, the lady that bought it had to pay $56 shipping, so she paid more in shipping than she paid for the for the book, so uh, something that heavy is going to cost, and I just call, I just charge actually shipping. I'm, I had uh, $56 on it. And, and that's exactly what, what it cost. I had weighed them before, as I was listing it, so I knew it was going to cost a lot. But, uh, anyway, I just wanted to get on here and show you what 65 pounds looks like. And, uh, like I said, you don't make much money, but if you run, run up on the set and you, you don't mind boxing up that heavy stuff like that, then you can make some money off of it. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Thanks for watching.